welcome all i am shefin today we are discussing on methyl alcohol methanol or methyl alcohol or wood alcohol was once produced by distillation and fractionation of wood its odor and taste were effective for some time in preventing its consumption by humans however once methanol could be deodorized cases of human poisoning greatly increased in number methanol is currently used as an industrial solvent for the production of other chemicals as an ingredient of antifreeze and as a paint remover it is also considered as a potential fuel methanol is a colorless liquid easily miscible with water and also on other solvent it is also added to industrial rectified spirit to render it unfit for drinking mixing of methylated spirit with alcoholic beverages by bodily guests or its inadvertent ingestion results in methanol poisoning metabolism of methyl alcohol methanol is metabolized to formaldehyde and formic acid by alcohol and aldehyde dehydrogenase respectively but the rate is 1 by 7 that of ethanol and follows zero order kinetics and the half of about 20 to 60 hours has been measured methanol is also a cns depressant but less inebriating than ethanol toxic effect of methanol are largely due to formic acid since its further metabolism is slow and fuel dependent a blood level of greater than 50 mg per dl methanol is associated with a severe poisoning even 15 ml of methanol has caused blindness and 30 ml has caused death fatal dose is regarded as to be 70 uh, 75 to 100 ml manifestation manifestation of methanol poisoning appears after a delay of few hours when its toxic metabolites accumulate these are omitting headache epigastric pain uneasiness drunkenness disorientation tachypnea dyspnea bradycardia and hypotension and also delirium and seizure may occur and the patient may suddenly pass into coma acidosis is prominent and entirely due to the production of formic acid This specific toxicity of formic acid is retinal damage, blurring of vision, congestion of optic disc, followed by blindness. Always precedes death, which is due to respiratory failure. Treatment: Keep the patient in a quiet, dark room. Protect the eyes from light. Gastric lavage with sodium bicarbonate if patient is bored within two hours of ingesting methanol. and also supportive measures to maintain ventilation and bp should be instituted and here is an image of gastric lavage combat acidosis by iv sodium bicarbonate infusion this is most important measure which prevent retinal damage and other symptoms large quantities may be needed Uh, which neutralize the sodium uh, the sodium bicarbonate infusion which can neutralize the acidic conditions next uh, potassium chloride infusion is needed only when hypokalemia occurs due to alkali therapy ethanol ethanol is preferentially metabolized by alcohol dehydrogenase over methanol at a concentration of 10 mg per dl in blood it aggregates alcohol dehydrogenase and retards methanol metabolism this helps by reducing the rate of generation of formaldehyde and formic acid ethanol is administered through a nasal gastric tube loading dose of 0.7 ml per kg followed by 0.15 ml per kg per hour because of the pharmacokinetics of alcohol changes over time and no iv formulation is available maintenance of uniform blood alcohol concentration is difficult alcohol blood level needs to be repeatedly measured 
Moreover, the enzyme saturating concentration of ethanol itself produces intoxication and can cause hypoglycemia. Use of ethanol for this purpose is tricky. Treatment has to be continued for several days because of temporary stay of methanol in the body is long. Hemodialysis Hemodialysis clears methanol as well as its toxic metabolite formate and hastens recovery. The drug Formipizole Formipizole is a specific inhibitor of alcohol dehydrogenase and the drug of choice for methanol poisoning which acts by retarding its metabolism. A loading dose of 50 mil, 15 mg per kg infused IV over 30 minutes is followed by 10 mg per kg every 12 hours till serum methanol falls below 20 mg deciliter. This has been found effective and safe and has several advantages over ethanol it's longer to have lack of inhibiting action and IV dosage form for regulating administration marketed as and is all not available commercially in India adverse effect burning pain in infused limb headache nausea taste disturbance and hypotension next one folate therapy the red calcium Glucoverin 50 mg injected 6 hourly has been known to reduce blood formate levels by enhancing its oxidation. This is a promising adjuvant approach. Next one ethylene glycol poisoning, which is similar to methanol, methanol poisoning. It can cause intoxic intoxication similar to methanol. Formipizole, used in the same manner as for methanol poisoning, is the drug of choice. That's the end of the presentation. Hope the topic is clear to you. Thank you.